<laughs> Hello and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I am going to be eating at Tim Hortons for 24 hours. I've eaten at Tim Hortons once when I went to the opening in Harlow and they've recently opened one near me. So I thought it was only right for me to eat here for 24 hours. We're actually currently sitting in a really long queue. So I've got someone's brake lights flushing in my face, hence why I'm a bit red. But before we get into the video, Happy New Year. This is going to be my first video of 2022. So I hope you guys all had a good Christmas. I also have my boyfriend joining me today. So therefore, we'll be trying lots of different things and we can get your your opinion on stuff i've had lots of questions and comments about that recently so i thought i'd quickly say it now if you didn't know then you mustn't have been watching any of my videos for december so go back and watch them and you'll get the answers you guys need <laughs> anyway i hope you guys enjoy this one if you do don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel if you're new here let's see what we had for breakfast we've arrived at tim hortons and we're hoping <sighs> look how cheap that is any breakfast meal available every day till 11 a.m £2.49. For £2.49. So what are you going to get? The big breakfast wrap or the original breakfast wrap? Big breakfast wrap. Okay. Big dog's got a rate. What's the next bit? <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to get the grilled bagel breakfast sandwich. I hate ordering at places I've never ordered it before. It is the everything bagel. You know there was like that big trend. You probably never saw it on TikTok but there was like a big TikTok trend. The everything bagel seasoning. Is that right? I can't remember what it was actually called. I'm going to get the French vanilla latte because I had that when I was invited to the one at, at Harlow and it was unreal. I mean, it's not, not Jumanji out there, isn't it? They're going to end up shutting the bridge today. Don't say that. Morning, I'll take your order, please. Hiya, can I get um, the big breakfast wrap meal? And what sauce would you like inside that? Brown sauce, please. Brown sauce, please. And what drink would you like? Orange juice. Do you have orange juice? Yep. Anything else? Yep. And then can I get the um, grilled bacon bagel? And what sauce would you like inside that? And what drink? Um, ketchup. And what drink? and um a french vanilla latte and can Anything i else? can i have is that with a meal yeah with a hash yeah, brown yeah all meals yep thanks your order number 568 that's come out the window please thanks i don't like to comment on people's customer services i yeah. just hate when people talk to you like shit. it's not necessary no they're gonna say oh what's your order number i'm saying i don't know i've got short-term memory loss so you new here <laughs> Are you excited for this? I am, yeah. I'm, I'm proper excited. Thank you. Thank you. Can we get some ketchup, please? Does it look good? Thank you. And you. Have a nice day. You have a nice day, boo. This is the wrap. Hash brown reveal. Oh, they're looking a bit... It's like a rice cracker. Mark down for that, aren't you, Tim? I have to, I have to mark them down because my favourite thing about a breakfast is is a hash brown bagel. Though that is, this is what I'm excited for. Everyone at McDonald's has been so upset that they got rid of the wrap and the bagel. Yeah, the wrap and the. So McDonald's now the that's probably why there's no queue at McDonald's. So I don't have a seeded bagel like the photo. Right, so that's what that looks like. It's covered in ketchup at least. I'm gonna go straight in. It tastes kind of vinegary. Oh, let's have so a bit, you're, you're gonna like it. Just don't trust people that don't like vinegar. Ew. Are you that is that? a lot of salt. Yeah, obviously I didn't mean to put that much on there. Can you just show the camera? Please show the camera. <laughs> God, guys, if you thought my bites were big, opinion? Yeah, it's all right. To be fair, how much did they cost? Fiber. Yeah, that's that's techers. That is really good. Just have a go to the pink. I don't like brown sauce though. There is no brown sauce in it. There is, I asked it for brown yeah, sauce. Yeah, it won't be at the top, will there? Oh, that's so dank, or? I was trying to do a bite like yours. Not going to the chair. Mmm. <laughs> mmm. It is a herby sausage. I reckon I could see off four of these. Four? Yeah. Should we do a competition? Alright. How many of these do I reckon I can eat three? quite ready. No, who can eat the most double cheeseburgers? Like a couple of blokes done it at work, but they got a bit over, they thought they could do like 10 each. No. And they didn't. I think five. Yeah, I could do five double johns, no worries. That's what I like about you. Like you get on board with the game. <laughs> I mean, anyone else is like, well, just one. You think like, no, if you was pushing yourself. Mm. You know what I mean? To your limits. Mm -hmm. Right, maybe I should have put the hash brown in there. No, because then you haven't given oh. it. 
<laughs> Look guys, that is how pale that is. That is not a good hush brown, I'm sorry. That is quite upsetting. My final verdict, if I was to get this again, which I would definitely get it again, I would get my main from there, and then I'd go to McDonald's and get the hash browns. No, don't be silly. It's fucking there. No. It's a two second drive. No. But that would be perfect. How can you claim to be a McDonald's hash brown lover? Yeah, I am. And then but... say you wouldn't drive right there. Okay, what about if you got the hash browns first? So what would you do? Eat it here and then go and get hash browns? No. So you'd let your food go cold while you... It wouldn't go cold. Come on. You know nothing. So you're just a dreamer. That's what you are. You dream. You didn't think of the logistics of this operation, did you? Okay, I would get the hash browns first. Ridiculous. They're gonna go cold first, uh, cold faster than this. You're a dreamer. You're not thinking about this. You live in a dream world. But ever since you met me, your dreams come true, and now that's all you do is think about a dream. But if you was laying in bed hungover and I said oh, I'm gonna go get us breakfast, you wouldn't mind then, would you? No, yeah, I wouldn't. I wouldn't do that to you. I'd say to you, I wouldn't get the you. rice cakes and we'll have them. <laughs> I'd rather have ones that I make in the air dryer. Oh, you make good ones, yeah. I think you'll really like this, because Becky doesn't even like coffee and she likes this. Do you know what? Go I enjoyed on. that. I would definitely get that again. Right, you know the egg in that? There's no egg smell. Mm. And you can see it says made with fresh eggs every morning. And I know McDonald's claim it too, but they smell up your shit when you eat McDonald's egg. The breakfast wrap in McDonald's was always like, you had like half the wrap was empty. That was filled to the top. Right, now do I go back now and get the donuts for later now? Yeah. Yeah. The breakfast wrap was the only thing that didn't make me feel sad. Like, literally, I felt sad after eating McDonald's breakfast. Not greasy at all, is it? No, that's the not. The bacon's much better. Guys, we're going back around now because I'm scared that donuts will run out because, to be fair, when I did that before, donuts had run out. So if we buy them now, I'm going to want to eat them now, to be fair. Should I try this now? No, well, you're going to try it, aren't you? Mm. Yeah, this is the absolute nuts nuts. It's honestly amazing. Better than that coffee you made me try before. Even I said that was horrible. It was from Starbucks and it was just a disaster. Up your game, Bucks. Morning, can I take all the plates? Can I get the apple caramel fritter, um, the caramel crula, the millionaire's caramel donut, uh, the Boston cream, old fashioned donut, yep, the apple fritter, please. Anything else? No, thank you. To be fair, if she's running both them things. Yeah, bless her. I feel that's, bad yeah, now. You shouldn't have slagged her off earlier. I know, I'm such a little bitch. <gasps> Caramel apple fritter, honey crula, billionaires, Boston cream, original glazed, and... Something they found behind the fridge by the looks of it. <sighs> a normal apple fritter. I think I had that one before. I feel like it's got biscoff in it. Should we eat a donut? Yeah, sure. <laughs> yeah, all right. And since they're open, it'll be very nice. So. We did just get them, and now we've seen them, we want to try one right now. Well, the first one we're going to try is the caramel apple fritter. So it says, caramel filled... With drizzled white fondant glazed and caramelized biscuits sprinkled on top. Right, guys, that's what it looks like. <gasps> I think it's got cinnamon. You're joking. No, I swear. <laughs> right, let me take another bite. And then you're going to get the really good bite. No. Hmm. Equal opportunities. Definitely got cinnamon in it. <laughs> That's a good, that's going to be the money back. To be fair, the cinnamon's not like overpowering. I can't taste the biscoff on top. It's because it's all falling off. Am I doing this in one bite now? Yeah, go on, all in one. Really? Mm. Go on. Yes. Winner, winner. I feel like I could smell the cinnamon, but I couldn't taste it, which is good for me. I could definitely taste it. Could you? Uh huh. <clears throat> to be fair, the original glaze doesn't look great, does it? No. Should we see it off? <laughs> Okay, <laughs> go ahead though. <laughs> do you, oh, do you know what? Some of them are like cake donuts. So this could be a cake donut. I don't know what that is. Is it not nice? No, it, it tastes like, you know what, hot donuts at the seaside, but cold. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? Doesn't it? It tastes doughy like that. I don't like it. No? Look at that. Has this got cinnamon in yeah, it? Yeah, it's got such cinnamon. Not in the nice cinnamon, like in the spicy cinnamon. We've still got all them to eat, so I'm not going to force myself into eating one I don't like. That one was Ming, wasn't it? Yeah, do not get the original glaze. No, he needs to start his game on that, doesn't he? Right, we'll see you guys for lunch. Right, it's time for lunch, and we are sitting in a very, very long queue for Tim Hortons. I'm going to get a wrap for sure, but I'm deciding whether to get a tuna wrap or a chicken wrap. What about with flippers, heads or tails? I just think a tuna wrap is very in your lunchbox for school. Right, so then... So then the other I just don't think it's very exciting. So then the other option is a chicken wrap, but you said you're getting chicken. 
Yeah, no, I'm just, yeah. But we'll, we both be getting beef for dinner. Yeah. I'm just trying to maximise how much I can eat to have different things. Okay, I'm going to get a chicken wrap and you're going to get chicken burger. Yeah. To go off some donut. I'm starving. This kid's taking forever. Oh yeah. Right, let's have a donut now. Say that about 20 minutes ago. I completely uh, forgot. Right, we're gonna try the millionaire donut one first of all. Oh my gosh. <laughs> that is so full. Let me take another bite. This one gets to my half and it's all empty over no. the other side. I don't know how I feel about that. Tastes a bit like coffee. Yeah, it does taste a bit coffee-ish. That's what I was thinking. Good amount of filling though. I mean, not that I can, that's what's left. It's got like two. I don't know how I've managed that. It's gone all around the outside. Yeah. Should we try the apple fritter? Because you want to try that least, don't it? I think it'd be really good. Always wanted to try this after years of watching. She's actually quit YouTube now. Megan McCullough. McConnell, I can't remember how you say it, but she used to eat these all the time, and I always dreamt about this day. <laughs> and the face is saying, <laughs> "Never meet your heroes." <laughs> well, that was completely dry. Look, nothing there. I'll get in there then. I am. I'm gonna keep going till I get the middle. Oh. <laughs> Come on, girl. I told you it looks like it's been kicked around the floor a bit. Cinnamon again. Oh dear. It's like a train. <laughs> oh, <gee now. laughs> All right. Why does everything smell like cinnamon in this gaff? You obviously like cinnamon in America. We know this. It's Canadian, isn't it? Canadian. Same people. Canadian. Canada. Has it got apple in it yet? <laughs> Your face. I didn't know I had apple in it as well. It's called apple fish on. Are they sure? They will when I chuck it out the window. I don't mean to manhandle, but it is completely dry. Where's the apple then? I had the only bit, obviously. It was oh, horrible. Oh, yeah. C convenient. Donut so far. Hit Vile. Hi, Cloud please. Hi, can I get the crispy chicken sandwich meal, please? What drink? A strawberry milkshake. And then can I get the crispy chicken wrap? Yeah, and um, what sauce in that? Um, Chipotle, please. Oh, good choice. Yeah. And uh, what drink? Um, a frozen lemonade. Anything else? No, thank you. Great choice from you. A lot of time for that. Pulled out of the bag, girl. Okay. Yep. Thank you. Can we get some um, ketchup, please? Ketchup, yeah. To be fair, he has put tomato sauce in the bag. He answered the assignment. He did. I didn't see that there. So that was only £13 again. How uh, much? That frozen lemonade looks not too great, does it? It's horrible. Oh, no, I don't say that. Got to give it a good stir. So I've got the frozen lemonade. Is it nice? and he's got the strawberry milkshake. No, not for you. It's nice, but it's very artificial flavour. Let's try mine. Do you want me to try your... Oh my God, that's so sour. Uh, oh. Right, here is my wrap. It's not overly full. It smells lovely though, that sauce. Yeah, it's a winner. There's the wrap, and this is what their lattice fries look like. What they're saying, I can hear a good crunch. That what? Is there sauce that I'm not sure about? That I think tastes quite vinegary. It's like what they're doing calves that. Mm. They water down the ketchup with the vinegar. Yeah. I love them. You're not keen? No, no, that's about. Oh, I love them. It's still very primary school dinner. My wrap's really stuck to the box. Yeah, I know. That's why you got what I've done earlier. So otherwise it rips it. Oh, a lovely little box yours comes in. <laughs> oh, that looks, it does look good. Not too big. I like the brioche bun. What did you think of that? Yeah, it's quite soft. Nothing worse when you get a burger in this side. Right? Stale. I wish I got tuna now. I feel like this was the safe option. What do you think? Not for me, but... Like you can't really go wrong with a chicken wrap. I have a feeling that's what I had when I went before. Mmm. Your chicken tastes completely different to mine. Yours is really thick and juicy. Mine's quite average. You got a chicken dipper? Yeah. Whereas yours is proper like a big breast. So anyway, everyone wants to know when and where we met. In the pub. I actually did answer this on Instagram because it was like my number one question. I was like, no one cares about me anymore. 
They just want to know about you. I'm just your sidekick, that's it. <laughs> Hannah come flirting her way over. I didn't. Who knows my friend, and we, this was when like you had to actually be seated at tables, so they had to come and sit with us, didn't you? Yeah, we didn't have a table. We didn't have a table. And then basically he just couldn't get enough of me. And she just was like, he was just head over heels for me straight away, wasn't you? Yeah. And this was like bank holiday. Do you know when I met him was when I had my lips dissolved. It didn't matter to me. Perfect just the way you were. So I had no lips. I was going for a crisis at the time. Midlife crisis? I was. That's why I agreed to go on a date. I wasn't feeling right. <laughs> you asked me out. <laughs> Don't forget that. I didn't ask you out. Let's not be liars. Really? Mm hmm. So I had golf the next day and you said, can I come golf? <laughs> did you not? Yeah. And did we go golf? No. Exactly. I was playing hard to get. So then you asked to take me out. I said, I'm I said can I come yours. golf and you said yeah and then we didn't go golf no. and then you I don't think we were at that stage in a relationship yet well fucking hell we'd only just met each other 12 hours before yeah so it was actually officially you because we didn't go golf so therefore that didn't count count I'd go golf with your nan <laughs> she's a professional Hannah's nan got a hole in one and everyone knows that's a big deal outside the golf course they've got a statue of her <laughs> Such an idiot. No, don't. That's another question is boyfriend reveal. When are we going to see your boyfriend? I already answered questions about this when I did my announcement in my assumptions video. But if you want to picture what he looks like, apparently my nan thinks he could be a policeman because he's so tall. What did you say to her? You think I'd look good in a uniform? Mm. So you said, Oh, can only tall people be policemen then? I'd never be a policeman. Is, is this male nice? I think it would be really nicer with chicken. It wasn't worth the wait. We've got to admit that part. It's definitely nicer to have something different there. Yeah, but I wouldn't be waiting in the queue outside like, like people standing there in the queue. It's very school dinner for me. I'm not going to lie to you. But what people won't understand is that when we was at school, yeah. school dinners aren't like what they used to be. Before Jamie Oliver come around, we did used to have chicken burger and chips. Yeah. Before we come along and ruined everything. I do agree with that comment. Now you've got to have avocado and hummus. I do really like these lace fries though. What about a strawberry milkshake? Mmm, it's right. I'm very full. Oh yeah. So well, the donuts have been the biggest disappointment for me. Oh really? Yeah. I just feel like everything had cinnamon in it. We went in too quick with our choices. I'm going in quick. Yeah, but surely like three donuts we've had and they all tasted of cinnamon. They've all had cinnamon in them. This is so sour. Mm. I'm so thirsty though. Should have got a normal drink. See you guys for dinner. And donuts. One minute. Oh my god. Oh my god. We're back for dinner. We was going to go in and eat in there, but we've decided against it, haven't we? I'm done. I'll go in there. No, it's too late now because I didn't bring my I didn't bring my tripod. Uh. Okay. Well, we was going to go home and eat it, but start again. No. We're, we're gonna Hi guys and welcome to my YouTube channel. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so we're here for the first time and there's no queue, which is fabulous. Okay, so I'm gonna get the Tim's Classic Burger and what are you getting? Oh no, I'm gonna get the Tim's Signature, right? Bacon, yeah, I'm gonna get Tim's Signature. Oh yeah guys, I should Double really, Classic Burger. I should really show them what it looks like, innit? Where's my phone? Hi, Taylor, please. Hello, can I get the Tim's Signature Burger meal, please? What drink? Uh, can I get Diet Coke? And the double classic burger, please. A Diet Coke as well, please. Anything else for you? No, Anything thank you. Well? All right, guys, I'm just filming on my phone because my window's actually a bit dirty. Anyway, yeah, it, it's, it's busy in there anyway, so I wouldn't have wanted to, you know, set up. No, this is behind the scenes stuff. This is, this is my setup, guys, in case you uh, cared. Should we just film them eating? Yeah. Yeah, let's film others eat. Should I go round there and interview them? Like, hi, so I'm filming my YouTube video. What have you wanted today? What do you think? Would you recommend? And, you know. So we got our Diet Cokes in this. I thought we'd get a cool Tim Hortons cup, but yeah, clearly drop, not. Drop the bottle there, Tim. So sorry about this lighting, guys. Better than eating it in, isn't it, really? Yeah. Because, it's got it, because on eating top. in, if you was eating in there, you probably wouldn't be able to hear me properly, right? Are you actually assessing what chips I get? Yeah. <laughs> I'm starving. Yeah. I've never done a triple threat in my life. Breakfast, you lunch, said and dinner I've never all in one eaten, um, Breakfast, lunch, and dinner in one place. Is that yours? Yeah. Okay, Is that better? Much. 
smells delish. Nice. What does mine look like? Okay, okay. <laughs> Meh. Where else have you eaten breakfast, lunch, and dinner all the time? McDonald's. I think that would make me feel so ill. Yeah, I did have a headache by the end of it. Greg's. I've done takeaway all day, but not one place. So I got beef burger with bacon, iceberg lettuce, cheddar cheese, tomatoes, red onion, mayonnaise, and maple and chorizo sauce. Wow. Yours is lettuce, cheese, and burger sauce. Burger sauce, underrated. Do you know what burger yeah, sauce jealous. is good on as well? Donna meat and chips, loads of burger sauce. Oh, haven't had Donna meat in so long. Nice. So sorry about this lighting, but it's like proper bit of red onion. It's not looking too appetising. I think when you, especially when you're going somewhere new, you've got to start off with the classics, surely. I did. You went with a signature. Oh, well, I wish I did get classic because mm -hmm. yours, the sauce in yours looks very good. Any good? I don't think I do want to buy it now. Really? Go on in. I was going to say, I want to buy yours. Pungent. I'm sad because I never get a burger. I was hoping it'd be good. It's okay. Should I go back and get the other one? Well, we are, yeah. Like, I don't want people to think I'm negative, but things have to really impress me to be good. Oh, 100%. Like, I can't, people like, say I I'm hate negative, it. and I'm like, I'm sorry. What do you want me to do? Tell you something it's lovely, you go and get exactly, it. Exactly, yeah. Your hopes are built up, and then I just let you let you sit there and burn. Waste a fiver. What for? Yeah, like a 10 out of 10 is pretty hard pressed to be perfect in every way. I just say, would I get it again? Because I feel like that's the most important thing. Doesn't mean it's not enjoyable. It hasn't, you know, got you going. Where would you rate this in between McDonald's, KFC, Burger King? That's a really hard question, I think. With McDonald's, we know what we're getting. We've had it for so many years, we know what we like. Yeah, that's why we... I don't ever go for signature stuff. Because you get it and you don't like it, that's you don't know it. Hmm. I have to assess the whole menu for me to then rate it. Like if I went but, Burger King and got a signature burger and then it was horrible and I think why didn't I get a chicken royale because you know what you get. Mm -hmm. well, definitely so it's better than KFC. Hands down. KFC don't hold any weight. Who's in charge of the chips at KFC? They only get worse. Right, I'm taking the first bite of this burger. Thank you for letting me have this moment. <laughs> mm. Oh, it's nice. That's much better. Oh my God, that's kind of like a Big Mac. He vibes in a bit. Yeah, I feel like this will fill me up more than a McDonald's. Yeah, it feels more like a proper burger because the, the patties are a bit fatter. Needs more burger sauce. I bet Canadians are like screaming at the screen. They're like, why have you ordered that? Like they're the worst things on the menu. Get them to uh, tell us what's the best. And they're probably not on par. Oh no, like when you have takeaways in America, they don't taste anything like they do here. I haven't tried both to compare. I need somebody who's Canadian to have our Tim Hortons yeah. and say if they compare or not. I remember when I had a Dunkin' Donut in America and I was like, what the heck is this? It was really naff. To be fair, I might have just picked a naff one. I can't remember what it was. I'll do that again. I would 100% get your one, but not the double. Why? I just don't really like burgers, do I? It's too much meat for me. You get a double and put one in mine then. So you can have a triple? Yeah. Okay, I'll do that for you. I think we need to go straight in for the donuts. Yeah. I was thinking about waiting until we got home or something. No, why do that? I can't wait. I so. <laughs> it's like that TikTok. Well, what have we got left? Hopefully some good ones. Boston cream and the honey caramel, no, the caramel cruller. All right, we're wondering her first. This, I don't know if you're going to like the texture. I had original when I had Tim Hortons before. Why would I it, not like the It's texture? a weird texture. I can't explain it. Please mm. tell me it don't taste like cinnamon because I don't weigh it in. No, I don't think it does. If it does, the seagulls are having it because it's going out the window. It reminds me of like a croissant and a donut. Oh, it's got gear inside it. What's that? Caramel all inside it. Mm. Yeah, we can work with that. That's a good one. Cool. Oh. That's the best one we've had. Oh, by far. Without a doubt. Like, how did Tim Fulton's manage to mess up an original glazed donut? Yeah, that's really got me down. I, don't, I think I might lose sleep about that. Like, texture. I think it's Visualisation, everything was just bad about it. I can't believe that we've come to Tim Hortons and we didn't get Tim Bits. <laughs> Do you get mm. that? Do you ever get hiccups? Yeah. That's why I don't trust babies. Because babies sit there and hiccup and they're fine. You don't bother them. How can you trust someone that hiccups doesn't bother? 
What do you want them to do? Well, have you like when, whenever someone gets hiccups, like you get annoyed, you get frustrated. How do you know that they're not annoyed? They can't speak. And they're just sitting there, aren't they? Happy. <laughs> Oh no, yeah, don't trust them. They're not trustworthy. Final thing we're gonna eat today. Let's hope it's good. This is the Boston cream. Who eats a Boston cream? Stephanie Buttermore. Mmm. We'll save the best two donuts for last. Oh, did I show the other one inside? I didn't, did I? What? You just taking every all the goodness out of the middle, aren't you? I've only eaten half, so it's not my fault if it's all in my half. I didn't ask for it. <laughs> Do you like it? You know what that is? That's just the round chocolate eclair. Interesting. I don't like eclairs. And they're made from shoe pastry. It's good because it's got more donut than the chocolate eclair. Yeah. But that's what it is essentially. It's a donut version of a chocolate eclair. Yeah, a round chocolate eclair. But I would say it's not. Guys, it's actually not. Do you know why? Cool. Because it's the white cream. That's custardy stuff inside. That's not white whipping what, cream. What, in here? Yeah. Hmm. You're not vibesing with it, or you just... No, I'm not. My ops on Tim Hortons, I feel like it'll be a go-to breakfast place. Mm, the hash browns are a joke. I would need to get the hash browns. I've had a great idea. I drop you at McDonald's, you go in for the hash browns, and you, do, you don't order them until I call you and say, I've just ordered the Tim Hortons. I come round, I pick you up, and we eat them together. Would you do that? <sighs> well, it looks like I am doing it now, <laughs> doesn't it? He's your brain waves. He's definitely not going to do it, but... Because <laughs> I know what will happen, we'll be hung over or something, and I'll be standing in McDonald's <laughs> at 12 o'clock in last night's clothes, feeling rough, and you're like, order them now. <laughs> and then I'll forget to pick you up. Yeah. Where would you place it in the in the drive through lineup? Better than KFC. Can't say it's better than Berg. No, of course it's not. But it has, like Burger King, you can't get breakfast there. You used to mm -hmm. be able to get Burger King breakfast, but nowhere oh, near Oh, Burger me King breakfast used to be the one. On away days, the little mini hash browns I used to do. <sighs> Never had one. Never had a Burger King mini hash Oh, they're powerful. Anyway, I'm going to end today's video here. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. If you did, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you're new here. As I said at the beginning, Happy New Year, and I will see you in my next one. Bye, driver. <laughs> Sorry guys, we're actually back in the room because we've just continued our discussion on Tim Hortons and he said, I thought better of you. Yeah, I thought better of you. With all your food knowledge, you said that you should have got a different burger. And I said, yeah, with your knowledge, I thought you would have played it safe, started going somewhere new, you'd get what they're, like, what they're known for. And you think that a signature burger is what they're known for. Yeah. Okay, so what are McDonald's known for? A Big Mac. Is that their signature burger? Yeah, what is this? What, when they get a signature burger on a uh, signature burger on a menu, is it called? What's it called? A signature burger, and you've never heard of it before, and then it goes after a couple of weeks. <laughs> signature burger is that like, is what they're known for. Are you you have got problems, don't even mind me up. You're winding me up, you've got to be. <laughs> McDonald's are known for Big Macs, double cheeseburgers. And that's yeah? their like, that's their I would that's say their that's classic. And then the signature is some John's made it up and then just thrown it in a box <laughs> and to get you all the maple bollocks so bacon stuff. So he thinks signature means like limited edition. I think signature means... That that's what they're known for. Yeah. But you've just proven yourself wrong. You just said McDonald's are known for uh, Big Mac. Exactly. But I'm that's not their signature burger. I've never heard of one of McDonald's at Burgers ever being brought up being a signature burger. Really? And there's another thing. Who <laughs> remembers when McDonald's done hot dogs for a while? <laughs> Because no one remembers this. It is a thing, I promise you. I'm going to do Instagram polls on both of these. Every time we do an Instagram poll, I lose. Exactly. Because but that doesn't I'm mean right, that I, right. no, that doesn't mean. So if if your people don't remember there being hot dogs at McDonald's, that doesn't mean you're right. It means you're all wrong, doesn't it? <laughs> so he's told me in the past. He's like, you're disgusting. That's my child, You're disgusting like. for That's licking your knife. And he was like, and I was like, everyone licks their knife. And he's like, no, they don't. So I did an Instagram poll. We're well, we going out for dinner, and you're licking your knife. I don't do it in public. You anyway, we're, we're really going to end it here. But let me know in the comments below who's right. <laughs> Right. Comment below signature if you agree. No, signature if you agree with him, and classic if no. That's the other way around. <laughs> so you don't even believe yourself anymore. <laughs> You're unbelievable. <laughs> McDonald's hot dogs. <laughs> if you're agreeing with me, you're commenting signature. Mm. If they're agreeing with you, they're commenting classic. Yeah. Okay. Bye. And about McDonald's hot dogs. Because we need to sort this out. Okay, bye again. Okay. <laughs> <laughs>